All right, so of course, this is the video where I announced the winner to last month's contest. We'll be doing another one in a couple weeks. In case you're new here, we do give away free retired sets every month during the year of 2023. It's a pretty exciting thing. Uh, very happy to do it because I want to show my appreciation to all of you. But of course, before I announce the winner, I just want to talk about a couple things real quick. All right, so right now you're looking at youtube.com and I want everybody, if you get a chance or have any interest, to go ahead and type in the, the title right here into the search box. It really is an interesting story, and I'm talking about this because it involves eBay. The short version of this story is that the former CEO and I think the number two person had a vendetta towards these two people that had a internet blog that talked about e-commerce and all that other stuff, and they plotted to ruin these people's lives. And this, this is not made up, totally have not heard about. I'm so happy that it made it to my algorithm because this is a crazy, crazy story. They enlisted other members from eBay on the corporate executive board and other employees from the loss prevention team, I believe. It's just a crazy story. eBay really tried to put the fear of God into these people. They attempted to ship them a pig fetus. They, it, it, this is just absolute crazy. So just wanted to share with you, check it out if you want. And that's pretty much it. So right now you're looking at the Wolf of Bricks YouTube channel and you can see the live tab right here. We are going to have a live stream this Friday. This video should be coming out on Thursday, so this should be tomorrow, the live stream. I was inundated with questions about the warehouse whenever we did the warehouse. That's probably the most popular video that I've ever released on my channel, which tells me that everybody wants to see more of it, so I'll have to go and take more video of it, right? But if you've ever had questions that you've wanted to ask me that you just haven't, be sure to go ahead and bring them to the live chat. It'll be this Friday, tomorrow at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and I hope to see everybody there. So before I share with everybody the winner, I had intended on having a huge announcement, but because of certain things, and I'm going to get into that in a moment, this is more or less going to be a teaser. So right now you're looking at images of Lego cases. These are cases that my partner who manages the warehouse with me have developed, put together, designed. And the big announcement during this video was going to be sharing with everybody that these are now available to sell. But the problem is <laughs> these cases are, have already sold out. These have been flying off the internet shelves, if you want to call it that. We've also have a partnership with Bricks and Minifigs, and they have ordered hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of these cases right now, and most of them are sold out. So I'm not going to share with everybody the name of the website, because if you went to the website, everything would say sold out. But this is something that is some growing pains and a bit of a learning process. But these cases are beautiful. Whenever I saw pictures, I immediately wanted to buy one and start collecting minifigs. Now, these aren't just for minifigs, right? This Batmobile right here, I don't know if you could see it. It is inside of a case, which is from the website that my partner now manages and owns. These cases are very durable. They are strong. They are made in the USA, which is very important. There are some other people out there on YouTube that are selling cases that are not made in the USA. And you can tell by that because their customers do have some negative feedbacks about how their scratches and all kinds of other stuff. But just wanted to share this with you as a teaser that this is something that is coming down the pike very soon. If you're near a Bricks and Minifigs and this interests you, go ahead, call them up, ask them if they have any brick shell cases. That's the name of the company. If they do have some, I guarantee you they're gonna be sold out very soon. Brentwood, Tennessee is completely sold out. They're on a waiting list. So just have a lot of exciting things that I wanted to share with all of you. All right, and finally, without further ado, we're going to go ahead and we're going to announce the winner. Now, the interesting thing is there's a lot of people overseas that wanted the Walmart box because they've never, they're not in an area where there's a Walmart, which I thought was interesting. But how luck turns out, it is not going to be a Walmart case. The winner of the contest is Jeffrey Fantine, and he says, I would like the Amazon box. I really enjoy the videos. Great. So I just wanted to share with everybody because I do have the box right here and I wanted to share with everybody what they were getting. I think in a contest video, I think I was implying that I wasn't going to open it up. And honestly, I can't remember what's in here. So I just want to share with everybody. And, you know, this is a part of the fun. All right. 
so Jeffrey will be winning <laughs> a Lego Batmobile tumbler, which I hope he's grateful for. This was the one set that has not gone up in value yet, but it's only been retired for three months, right? So what exactly do you want? Now, we did not reach the 500 comment mark, unfortunately, so Jeffrey will not be getting a, a Wally Brickheads, but that's okay. He's going to be getting a nice new retired tumbler. Jeffrey, if you don't mind, go ahead and shoot me an email at wolfalbricks at gmail.com. Just kind of verify who you are, and I'll be able to send it out to you. That's it, friends. Hope it wasn't too long of a video. Thanks for participating in the contest. It does help us out. And everybody, if you don't mind, please make sure you participate in next month's contest where we will be giving away another set. As always, I'm Jim from Wolf of Bricks. Always go out there and get it.